So what I have here is a lead emitting diodes. We have four different types. Large type and small type and square. These two. We have white, yellow, green, blue, and red. Here. So someone claiming that there's a gold here. I have seen YouTube video that doing gold recovery and silver recovery from this type of material. But I did not see the gold at the beginning of the video. I only saw the gold at the end of the video. So I want to prove it to myself. So come and join with me. So let's say it together. After looking to our magnifying glass, I found that there is a single wire banding inside connecting to each other here. And let's take a look if this wire is really gold. So let's do it. Let's burn our lead emitting diode here. is completely burned. So let's try to crush the remaining carbon here with we can do Now our small amount of material here is added to our pan and let's see what we got. We add a small amount of 
so powder to break the water tension So we separate first the metal so that we see clearly what we got. This is also containing silver accordingly. Okay, after removing the metal, and, uh, this is our collected small, very small amount of gold wire here, very tiny. Yeah. So, this is how to... Now I pro now I probed it to myself that there is gold on lead emitting diodes but not much actually as you can see here so let's take a closer look with our magnifying glass there are some wire bonding isn't uh, hits with our blotters and some tiny a gold wire here has melted into a very tiny particle but not much so that was the if you have a large amount of this material then it's okay for gold recovery but if you recover gold with this type of material in a small amount then you got almost nothing just like what I have so thanks for watching and I think our trials is a success so we saw a small amount of gold but not a, what we call on that uh, worth for Gold recovery.